Hi guys, welcome back to Phoenix's Poems and Quotes to Inspire Your Day. I'm Phoenix and today's poet is Stan Stanley Kunitz. Stanley Kunitz was born in 1905 in Worcester, Massachusetts. He attended Harvard College for both his bachelor and master's degrees and then went to the army, although he did request for conscientious objector status, he was denied. And so following the war, he began teaching first in Vermont at Benetton College, and then later at the universities of Columbia, Yale, Princeton, Rutgers, and finally the University of Washington. He's written many books of poetry, including um, collaborations with other poets, and has many honors, including the Pulitzer Prize, and was named um, the United States Poet Laureate of the year 2000. The poem I'm going to recite for you today is The Layers by Stanley Kunitz. The Layers by Stanley Kunitz. I have walked through many lives, some of them my own, and I am not who I was, though some principle of being abides, from which I struggle not to stray. When I look behind, as I am compelled to look before I can gather strength to proceed on my journey, I see the milestones dwindling toward the horizon and the slow fires trailing from the abandoned campsites over which scavenger angels wheel on heavy wings. Oh, I have made myself a tribe out of my true affections and my tribe is scattered. How shall the heart be reconciled to its feast of losses. In a rising wind, the manic dust of my friends, those who fell along the way, bitterly stings my face. Yet I turn, I turn, exalting somewhat, with my will intact to go wherever I need to go, and every stone on the road precious to me. In my darkest night, when the moon was covered and I roamed through wreckage, a nimbus-clouded voice directed me, Live in the layers, not on the litter. Though I lack the art to decipher it, no doubt the next chapter in my book of transformations is already written. I am not done with my changes. Stanley Kunitz is known for also for some quotes, and I want to read you a few. We have to learn how to live with our frailties. The best people I know are inadequate and unashamed. I can hardly wait for tomorrow. It means a new life for me each and every day. And this is the last one. When you look back on a lifetime and think of what has been given to the world by your presence, your fugitive presence, inevitably you think of your art, whatever it may be, as the gift you have made to the world in acknowledgement of the gift you have been given, which is the life itself. The work is not an expression of the desire for praise or recognition or prizes, but the deepest manifestation of your gratitude for the gift of life. Have a wonderful day, you guys. I wish you well on your journey to find your own gift and to share it with us. And be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and I'll see you soon. Bye!